should a married woman have male close friends? I think it's, from a married perspective, it's difficult. It's not impossible, but it is difficult because, you know, taking from, from my perspective, I might think, okay, it's fine, you know, there's nothing wrong, I know we're friends, I know there's no issues, mm -hmm. but I think it's just creating an opportunity to, for my husband to think something else because even though I trust myself mm -hmm. and he might trust me, but saying, oh, this, you know, man calling me, this man, you know, we're going to the cinema, this man, you know, we're sending each other messages, the mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. it, that is what I would do with yeah. a friend. Let me swing, let me swing, let me swing, let me swing to this. Um, no, definitely not. It's not advisable, I would say. It's a tricky one because when you do have a male close friend, that means you share... No, first and foremost, why are you having a male close friend as a married woman anyway? I mean, no. Safer to not be friends, especially one where you have to confide in them. Mm. Now, it's okay. a different thing whereby I say, for example, I'm married as well. So if my husband does something, I might want to call a male friend to get a male perspective. You know, mm. in that instance, then yes. But having a friend that is like my girlfriend, you know, my husband does something, I call him, I moan about it. I think it's exposing yeah. yourself a little bit. I, I trust myself, but I might not trust a circumstance because we can all be vulnerable. Yeah, we're all human. If you do have close male friends, it's more, it's dangerous. I mean, things can happen. Things can go from zero to a hundred, like real quick. Um, no. If it's just a friend, then yes. But if it's a close friend that you literally share everything with someone you call up, you hear, I mean, your close friend is somebody you call so often. Every little thing happens, you hit them up. So does that mean when you have a problem in your marriage, you hit them up and tell them, oh, my husband is not doing this, my husband's doing that? It's a little bit tricky one. Now, if you're single, I mean, why not? I mean, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Go for it. But as a married woman, mm -mm, I would Thinking about it from my perspective, am I okay with my husband having a female friend? Well, that would be the next question now. Okay? <laughs> you know, how comfortable I, I am would absolutely you be? My husband not. has female friends. So, okay. I, I, I think it's he can have friends where they see each other at parties, mm. have fun, but like he has so many male friends. Like, what's wrong with a male friend? Okay. Why, okay. you know. So, you're sounding like me right now. Let's go to the one that has a friend, you know, that husband has female friends. So how do you do it when you say he has female I, friends? I think, you know, he's I mean, he on knows, the phone and... Oh, he has friends that are female. Yeah. That yeah. is my classification and they speak, it, be it for work purposes. I think as, for, as long as I'm aware and he makes me comfortable enough. So I think the onus is on him to make me comfortable and he doesn't mm -hmm. turn me into some form of spy detective who's yeah. always wondering. Yeah. So if he makes me comfortable and he doesn't hide things, so for example, you know, he tells me, oh, I'm meeting up with X, X, and X. I ask you a few questions. You answer me, and you're not, you know, going. You know, I think if you put the person in a position like, okay, you're meeting the person, but why can't you say where you met? Yeah. You know, why can't if I ask a question, why can't you just answer freely the way I, you would answer if you were meeting a male friend? Yeah. So I think the onus is on if we have to have male friends or female. friends, Friends, mm -hmm. The onus is on us to make our spouses feel comfortable. comfortable yeah, in so yeah. that. I mean, what's the benefit of having a male close friend? Having a male friend is good, but having a close male friend is a little bit tricky. It's it's almost like me saying I don't want I don't like double standard. If I say yes, it's okay, then that means it's okay for husbands or for men to actually have close male female friends. Now that's a no. I mean. Yeah, that's a no, like, seriously. <laughs> I mean, this topic is something that I can talk about the whole time. Now, whilst I don't disagree in having a friend, having a male friend, I think there are things you'd learn from a male friend. Um, and then it's good to have, you can't just be a woman and have just female friends. You should be able to have friends at work, at a church, you know, anywhere. But I think the most important thing is building a bridge between that relationship there must be a line draw a line uh if you must have a, an opposite sex um relationship there must be boundaries you know certain things you don't do the certain time of the day you don't call each other um you just got to respect that the other person is in a relationship um you just got to respect boundaries i think you know i'm not saying it doesn't work i know i know you know there there are situations where 
the woman does have a male friend or the man has a female friend and it's work for them and i say it's work for them it doesn't mean the other party or the other part or half of the marriage is happy with it but they've been able to make it work but i think it's more dangerous because you you're more inclined to call your best friend up to tell them about the issues you're going through in your marriage so if your best friend is your opposite is, is an opposite sex then that means that's going to be the shoulder you cry on and you know what they say about a shoulder you cry on someday is always very close to the lips. You know what I mean? Like you put your head on the shoulder and you go, I'm sorry. It's okay. The moment you raise your head up, it's like, oh, child. So, yeah, it's a little bit too close for comfort, I'd say.